This is IcoBlue Digital Radon Gas Monitor. A lot of people still don't know what is radon. Radon is dangerous. If you live in North America, you're gonna know this gas. It's colorless, you can't smell, there's no taste, but it's in the air. Some area is more uh, popular, some, some area is not that popular. I got a map here, this North America, you see a lot of places that have the radon. The gas is dangerous to people, it's causing a lot of cancers, so especially the basement. Sometimes you, you put your kids into the basement for them to play in or sleep in there. You feel it's safe and pretty cool inside there, but actually maybe not. So this product is actually detecting the radon. So in this video, I'm going to open the box. Let me do an initial test. This is the monitor itself, and it got digital display. On the back, there is a USB charging, and now this is a little clip, so it can sit on the table. And then, they got charger, so now I'm going to plug that one in. All right, so now it's been plugged in, and uh, it need about 10 minutes for reading, and now I'm just wait. While I'm waiting for the result, I'm gonna introduce some of the functions that's very important. You see here is the R, it means real time. It, it, it detecting like every 10 minutes, they analyze how much radiance in your home. And the second is daily. And the third one is weekly, monthly, long term. So why that's important? Because the air is kind of up, fluctuate. You open the window and the wind blow, so the radar may be low. But sometimes it's just maybe very high concentration. You need to know both of the real time and even the long time. Probably you just want to monitor like how about the past month, right? You just switch to the different modes, give you the result. So usually the radon get into the house is from the basement, from the concrete crack or there's no concrete or just a kind of cross spacing. There may be some radon just seeking through a house. So if you want to check the higher concentration should be in the basement. But usually if you don't go down there, so basically you put this one into your living area so you know exactly what you're getting in your home. And now it shows the result, um, 0.86. It actually can detect a very wide range from 0.2 to 99. So uh, basically if it's above the threshold, it will alarm, let you know what's happening. But if, you, if this is initial, they will update every uh, like 10 minutes, they will update another number. All right, hopefully this video will help and uh, keep safe.